How Taylor Swift is Spending Her Time Off From The Eras Tour Taylor Swift was among the thousands of Kansas City Chiefs fans recently celebrating the NFL team's birth in this year's Super Bowl. The anti-hero singer rushed the field after the AFC Championship win, immediately pulling boyfriend Travis Kelsey into an embrace and later sharing a kiss. Swift has been a fixture at Chiefs games since September 2023, and the couple's every move has been closely watched, especially the Midnight's stars. Here's a look at a few times Swift has turned heads since going public with her and Kelsey's relationship when she's not performing for her wildly successful Eras tour. Since attending her first Chiefs game in September 2023, Swift has gotten closer to Brittany Mahomes, the wife of Kansas City Chiefs quarterback Patrick Mahomes. The two are often photographed together watching games and cheering on their men. Their friendship has extended beyond the football stadium. The two have been spotted out to dinner multiple times with a group of girlfriends or on their own. During one of the games, cameras captured Swift and Brittany celebrating with a secret handshake. Patrick later told CBS this morning, Swift is part of the Chiefs' kingdom at this point. Admitting her handshake with Brittany is better than his and Travis. It's cool that she's embraced Brittany and they've built a friendship as well, Patrick told the outlet in December 2023. So, for me, it's Travis, man, and he's lucky enough to be with a great girl and a great woman, and it's been cool to interact with her. Swift has fully embraced the role of a football player's girlfriend, attending Kelsey's games in full Chiefs gear on multiple occasions. Her presence at the games has created some controversy. Many fans are annoyed she takes up so much screen time during game broadcasts. There's a camera, like, a half mile away, and you don't know where it is, and you have no idea when the camera is putting you in the broadcast, so I don't know if I'm being shown 17 times or once, she told Time Magazine in December 2023. I'm just there to support Travis. I have no awareness of if I'm being shown too much and pissing off a few dads, brads and chats. David Letterman, former host of The Late Show, stood up for the singer, telling all the haters to shut up, in a video he posted on social media, adding that Swift and Kelsey are bringing something positive and happy for the world. We live in a world now where all we hear is nonsense and ugliness, he said in a video he shared on social media. And the nonsense can't be more nonsensical. And the ugliness, God hopes it can't get any uglier. But that's all we hear. That's all we hear. So, now, here's Taylor Swift, who is a glowing bright light of goodness in the world, and she starts dating Kelsey Grammer. When she's not supporting her man or hanging with other WGs while she's on a break from touring, Swift is with her pals, including actress Blake Lively. The two were spotted out together in New York in early January. Swift was wearing a velvet green dress and patterned knee-high boots, and Lively was wearing a multicolor striped sweater and a brown miniskirt. In November 2022, Lively's husband, Ryan Reynolds, told Entertainment Tonight his entire family is obsessed with Swift and her Midnight's album. Later that month, Swift thanked Lively when she won Favorite Pop Album at the American Music Awards after Lively directed her in the music video for I Bet You Think About Me, calling her my beautiful, brilliant friend and my director. The singer walked the red carpet at the 2024 Golden Globe Awards in a shimmering green dress and diamond earrings. She was there as a nominee in the award show's newest category, Cinematic and Box Office Achievement, for her concert movie, Taylor Swift. The Eras Tour. The movie grossed over $261 million at the worldwide box office, raking in $93 million its opening weekend. Ultimately, the movie lost to the summer's biggest blockbuster, Barbie.